people to just a warrior for fat. But you know, you will comport. <laughs> you will be a you will overcome. <laughs> so Mrs. Sally, hey, make a comment. A positive comment. He say this man not invite Tunana in page. You know, ask Tuna for Kana in page. Maybe never even sabi una self. Be just the add number na me small tasty. You know, never even sabi una self. Say now invite Tuna in page. Na in page. You see, but every day you the Kana in page for make a comment. Say hey, salon ni badat. So what I need for left this. Started his YouTube channel in two thousand and and 10 you know that's when he started his youtube channel um he was deported at one point in time and y'all don't know who tasmo sleaze is but for us that's in the states that's in the dmv area that grew up in the 2000 i went to tc williams you know what i mean annandale you know what i mean woodbridge area you know we know who tasmo sleaze is man he's been in the scene for a while you know what I mean, right? It's just unfortunately, um, circumstances are way different than all of these other artists out here. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Shit happens where he had a contract, went to California for a little bit, and yeah, he started crushing shit. And then the law said, you know what? We tired of your ass. We're gonna send you back to you, and then back to Sierra Leone he go. You know, for me personally, I've always been in contact with him, even till uh, recently when he started going on, fa uh, on Facebook Live, man. Uh, you know, uh, me and him got together, link up, and gave him a little pointers, and uh, he's doing his thing on uh, Facebook right now. But let's check the song out that he dropped uh, 11 years ago, and you tell me what you think. You tell me what you think. And you know, everybody have their own favorites, you know what I mean? Let's just see if this brother have what it takes to be a superstar in Sierra Leone. Forget uh, 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 the politics side, forget who your favorite artist is. Just judge his uh, his song and we're gonna break the bars down, you know what I mean? Let's go. We don't see. You hear the beat, right? We don't see. Now this this song, this the original song, uh, uh, this beat that he sampled is a Afro uh, is an Afro beat. Like this is the time where people don't even uh, 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 like Afro beats like that, or they even know what it what it was. This was 11 years ago. You know what I mean? Yeah. We don't see. We don't see. We don't see. We want them. Oh, we don't see. Yeah. He said, Oh, we don't see. Don't you mind them? We don't kill. We don't want them. Oh, we don't see. Don't you mind them? Come, we don't kill. We don't want them. Oh, we don't see. Don't you mind them? We don't kill. We don't want them. Oh, we don't care for push them and kick them fast. We know they so I'm waiting for them to know they fast. I'm going to fuck the girl, my girl, and get shot. Lord, go back and you what he said. Oh, so we don't care for push them and kick them fast. We know they so I'm rich because they know they fast. So I'm fucking girl, my girl, they get checked with stars someday. So it's Alex and I'm posting a talk board. But this is not 11 years ago, past Tasmo come on and then I ask her, what's in the talk board? You know what I mean? But it's Alex say, the intro of this song, we don't see, we don't know if na, na song would possibly don't release at that time, at that era, because this is 2010, man. You know, about 12 years ago, in a way, you know, and I, I, I don't know. Say one for duplicate and tiff me style. So this nigga be the always, you know, in, 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 like just think about that. Right? About ten years, twelve years ago, he was rapping about niggas duplicating and taking his style. This is what twelve years ago. You know what I mean, right? He's been saying the same thing. He's saying now. We don't know if not Cardi Nero in the talk boy, if not LNJ in the talk boy, but uh, Cardi Nero been in the scene for a long, long time, bro. He's been in the scene since this man was doing music, since Tasmo was doing music. So it's possible it could be talking about Tasmo, it could be talking about DMG, Cat, Cat House and them, you know what I mean, right? Cat House Records, they know who uh, this man is. <laughs> 
I'll go back man. I record this song, it's not well produced, I'm not gonna lie. If it was well produced, I, you know, I would be able to hear it. That's what a lot of Taz mostly is, is uh, songs is releasing right now, they're not well produced at all. So it's really difficult for audience to hear what he's saying or to even vibe with it because you can hear uh, 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 the ripples, you can hear the echoes in the background, you can hear a lot of, you, you can tell it's not well produced, you know what I mean, right? So let's go back a little bit and try to hear what he's talking about. So he said, I'll taste them all. You know, at this moment, Taz mostly is at one point in time was a, uh, you know, you know what I mean, right? He get in, you know, get work done. So. Um, always saying with new fresh stuff, bro. You know, me personally, he put me on to the scene. You know what I mean? Like me and I simple man, man. I know I no problem, man. But because at times mostly is man, he will expose me to a lot of, you know, the hip hop scene, the hip hop life. You know what I mean? That nigga is the type of nigga that will take off your head. You know. Let's go back and listen to that because I heard that one clearly now, man. Yeah. You see, try to steal my fans. I promise you, man, it gotta be it gotta be something, a beef that he was beefing with somebody. Man, I wish I would ask this nigga who this is, man. But you know, see, you know, see. think man what do you guys think i mean i'm gonna definitely do another reaction now this uh, uh channel that's this song is on that you can go hear the whole track yourself it's a old channel that he started a long time ago you know what i mean and he's not even active on it anymore because i'm sure he don't have the information to log in you know he started this youtube channel in 2010 you know that's when he started his youtube channel um, so, just like I was saying, Taz Mosley's has been the guy that's always been uh, getting in trouble with the law here in the state. So, he was deported at one point in time, and and you know Salon now, you know the country, you know what I mean? So, me, I sure say, you know, 10 years after, because he got deported right after he created this YouTube page. <laughs> found out shit happened, got set up, you know what I mean? So went back and um, been trying to push him to stay focused on the music, but you know, people had their own plans. So this man wanted to get his education. He wanted to uh, educate himself. And now he's ready to come up in the spotlight. Now, bro, look, man, this man is incarcerated right now. So I need everybody that's watching this, that if you savvy tells mostly, you, just, you know you're in talk to on Facebook or whatever the case it is, man. Please, man, look question the government gonna release this man, man. This man, I understand, say what he do is very, very uh, wrong, and you know what I mean. And it's not good uh, for one man to incite a whole ethnic group. It's, it's definitely wrong. Uh, I truly believe that he learned his lesson. He is need to matter be the big man. If they pardon a convicted murderer, 
you know, pardon Charles Mosley's man, you know what I mean? Uh, in, in, get good intention, you know, get bad intention at all, man. I promise, you know what I mean? This man, um, the, a very strong leader, very passionate leader, and you know what I mean? I for, I for, uh, help the brother out, man. Beyond style, I'm out, man.